door and we found out that the mark that Celica has is the mark of the royal family and they're the only people who could take care of, who could seal away Duma's power. So pretty much that's how <laughs> things are going. Um, in this episode, this is the second time I'm actually recording this. Uh, I actually had to replay through the entire game. So my team is different. Um, I'll go over them real quick. The only, actually, the, I believe the only difference is that Faye is a healer. I believe that's the only difference in our entire team, and that's the only difference I made, actually, for both squads, so everything else is exactly the same. Uh, because I, I, I learned that Faye learns Physic pretty early, but freaking Silk never did, so that was, uh, frustrating. So I had Physic early in the game, and my entire team is really evenly leveled, I'd have to say. So, except for people like Claire, who's really strong, and Alm, who, uh, just classed up to Hero when he was, like, level 14 or 15 before he did that. And, yeah, so we've just had a good group, and actually, currently, the entire team is organized in the order that I got them. So, I don't know why I decided to do that, but, uh, Celica's team should be exactly the same. Except that I was able to promote, uh, what's her name? Sonia. And I believe that's the only difference there. So we're gonna get started here. So I kind of know what happens here in the next coming cutscenes. This one, there's no cutscene. It's literally just a battle. Um, is there? Is it? No, 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 no. There's a cutscene here. I'm, I lied. I lied. This fortress is the last thing standing between us and Regal Castle. Good news for us. But to them, it's their last line of defense. And men always fight hardest when their backs are to the wall. Let's take every precaution we can. Right. We only get one chance. We'll make it count. <laughs> Marvelous! Welcome, ladies and gentlemen of the Deliverance. Slayed? Indeed! And I am dearly glad to see you again, boy. You really are full of surprises. To think a mere far more like you would become leader of the Deliverance. Or that you would now stand poised to claim the Regalian Empire as well. It's the stuff of legends, this is. Simply astonishing. Why are you here? Last I checked, you served to say. True, but that was in a former life, when I was still a knight of Sophia. What? You lot ran me out of the castle thanks to that Claude de Say's incompetence. So, I defected to Rigel. Turncoat or no, they pay good coin for a noble's intelligence on the enemy. They were so grateful, in fact, they appointed me to captain this fortress. You lack even a modicum of shame, Slade. How dare you call yourself a noble after trading away your pride? Pride? Ha! Pride has never filled a man's belly or warmed it in the snow. And while we're speaking, Clyde, let me tell you this. I've always despised you. You and your pathetic platitudes. Pride this, honor that. Only a naif believes that righteousness will keep a man drawing breath. Which of us is truly naive, Slade? You're focused on not but survival, yet survival to what end? With no core belief to steal your spine, you turn tail at every shadow. Men broken by life's unfairness who cast all principle aside will never triumph. You, Slade, will never know victory. We will not lose to the likes of you. Clive. <clears throat> Silence. Silence! This is merely the desperate barking of a cur faced down by a lion. Well, don't stand there. Attack. Yeah, and I think Clive is the lion. Silence their lies, even if it means cutting the tongues from their mouths. So yeah, uh, I wouldn't have bothered replaying through the entire game had cutscenes like those, and before the chapter where uh, Alm and Clive were talking back and forth. If I could either either play those cutscenes again in the game, or if I could get those online, which I could not find them. So yeah, I had to just replay through the game and. 
it went a lot smoother this time. I played a lot more recklessly, so I probably lost more units than I did in my original playthrough. But anyways, I know the strategy that I want to do here. I'm going to employ the same one that I used last time. What I did last time is I had one group go up this side, and the other this side, which means that we can take out these groups <clears throat> along the way, and then we can come up here and we can double team him and take him out because he's not that he's not that strong, to be honest. Uh, so we could we could kind of easily beat him. So well, actually, Delthea became a priestess. Um, I think she became a priestess the last time because I remember mentioning that she actually listened to me and she put on pants. <laughs> actually, I wonder I wonder if that was that in, in that episode that I actually ended up losing. Crazy. I don't think I skipped any supports. And I don't remember if Claire ever got to Falcon Knight. She probably did. She's a Falcon Knight now, at the very least. All right, here we go. We're going to get started here. So I'm going to have this group go over here, and these guys go over here. So technically, these guys have one more per, uh, one more guy. Because I would say Silk is probably the least important out of everybody. She doesn't do much, in all honesty. She doesn't have physics, so she's not super useful. We have three horse units going this way. Oh, Zeke, well, Zeke and Tatiana got their seat. They didn't get anything more. Why, why did I do that? Damn it, Caleb. All right, well, let's try that again. Um, yeah, Silk's not super useful just because she's got, she does not have physic. And, uh, yeah, and my other two healers do. So, they're much more useful. We have plenty of projectile shooters to protect our heavy knights. These guys are going to be doing the bulk of the damage to the, uh, others. <laughs> Poor Silk. Of course you always go for Silk. Ow! Okay, you have fly, extra flyer damage. Um, hang in there, Faye. Okay, thank goodness. Ay ay ay. Now, I mean, I guess I technically have Cliff, but I'd rather him do damage because he can... Never mind, he can't do much of anything. Cliff levels up to level 2. <laughs> Being a sage. Okay, I just also realized we have animations off, but gosh dang it, I really needed Python to hit those. I really wish I had a unit like Azura, but I really wish I had... What the heck? Oh, it was definitely showing red. See, the little bit that hangs over the side makes me think that that tile is lit, but I can't tell. Oh, I hate it. Alm can do decent damage with his bow. He literally takes only two, but he misses one. Okay, let's Excalibur your face. Because you have a... There you go. Way to go, Luthier. Thank you. You're the man. He levels up. Nice. He learned Sagittae. Alright, you have a 22% chance to crit, Claire. Thank you. You're the bomb! Yeah, she has actually been amazing. Ah, well, never mind. She still got hit, but hey. I guess that she actually was able to kill the dude, so that helps. But she levels up to what? Level 8. Yeah. I wish I had thought of that. <laughs> and Silk levels up to level 2. This side always went much better. That's gonna hurt. I mean, 6 resistance isn't too bad, to be honest. So 14 damage, I can definitely deal with that. They're gonna go for Gray, which is unfortunate, but he's gonna dodge. Gray to bomb. Okay, you're gonna go for Lucas, but... Alright, that hurts. Oh, gosh damn it, Mueller. Please dodge, Claire, I need you. She's got... Oh, uh, well, at least she survived. She's... She never... He never missed a shot, even with his 65%. Thank you. Okay, hang in there, Faye. Fuck. This is so bull, man. I mean, to be honest, this would be so much more fair if I had if the bows were like they were in the other two games I Fire Emblem games I played. Where you only can hit from two spaces away with a bow. Three spaces if you have a long bow. But no. This game's like, fuck that. Thanks, Grit or Luthier. Why did you not crit? Um, if you could, like, crit. Oh my god. 
See, my luck in, in this game is bull. It's terrible. I'm ready. Well, that's good, Zeke. Taunting on levels up to level 2. Why don't you- I wish you had the frickin' javelin. Who has the javelin? Why does no one have a javelin? That's something I don't understand. Alright, we're frickin' attacking the big dude. If we can break through these guys, the easier it'll be to win the map. Alright, good job, Matilda. Maybe I should have let Clive attack, because he has a higher attack. My phone hit one and this dude's gone. Thank you. It was you or me. Thank you, Cliff. Alright, we got one Bonite done. Over here. Well, the second one gonna be done. He's gonna crit both of them. Some of my magic users are really bad on this team. Well, I hope you can. I kinda need you to. Okay, I'm gonna go for it. You are the bomb, Silk. I needed you to do exactly that, and you did. Yeah, you're damn right she does. Holy cow. Alright. Beautiful. Hang in there, Zeke. 14, he's good. Okay. Because we already got rid of the other mage. <sighs> Fuck you. Man, I hate the bows. The bows, and he's gonna crit and kill Tatiana. This game is... I really hate the bows. The bows are stupid. This wasn't nearly as tough as the last time. And I have a much better team than I did the last time. Alright, wait a... Thank you for actually attacking Tobin. He's gonna do 9 damage. Alright, Tobin. Do the bomb. <laughs> I need to get a magic user to beat him up. There we go. Okay, so he broke in through one side. He's gonna go straight for Matilda. A Zeke has the... <laughs> this may just kill him. See, look, just look how good Matilda is. Matilda's like the best. Great job. We can take out Slade on this next turn. <laughs> Alright, Tobin's gonna crit there. Let's see if he crits the second he is. Alright, so he's gonna do 18 damage, which is really good damage. Um, so now I know what I want to do here. I'm gonna have you come up here. You're gonna heal up Zeke. And then I'm gonna have Silk warp Luthier to the other side. Well, not exactly what I wanted, but I don't have to... I'll suppose that'll work. So I can't attack, so we're kind of done here. Alright, Python. He's gonna crit. Sweet. Thanks, Python. I needed that guy down. He helped me out there. Thank you. Alright, goodbye. Wait, what? Okay, he was hitting twice. I don't know why I forget that every single time. Yeah, we're just gonna let Matilda take out Slade. And Slade is actually dead now. Well, it's okay. You're gonna be just fine, Clyde. Who cool, didn't I move yet? Gray. Speaking of Gray, he's gonna get hit by a magic attack, but it'll be okay. Yeah, that's not gonna do much to Clive at all. With 14 defense, I mean, he dodges anyway, but with 14 defense. Nice! You had a really bad chance to hit, but you still did, so good job. Hang in there, Silk. And that's gonna be Silk, isn't it? Yep. This game is bull, bro. I ha I really do hate that. Alright, here comes Zeke with the writer's vein. <laughs> Zeke! God, you anger me. Oh, I can't even move anymore. That's such crap. Frickin' just please all and kill him. Okay, goodbye. Just to rub it in, you're getting crit. Douche. Uh, now I have... I don't have anything to... Shoot. Well. 
they're gonna be stuck there for now. Okay, that knight's finally down. Or Baron, whatever. And goodbye. 37% chance to hit, that is so dumb. Can you fuck off and just leave Grey alone? God, oh man, I hate them. Yeah, thanks, Mueller. Goodbye. Kid, do nothing to Tobin. You didn't even hit, so. I'm just, I'm not caring. I'm skipping through your stupidness. You missed and... How? See, the luck in this game is so crap. I only did seven damage. Nice. Okay. Simple turn. Way to go, Tobin. He levels up to level six. You're gonna get crit. Goodbye. Alright, Alm. Thank you. There we go. Thanks, Python. Level 4 for him. Yes! I'm always just sitting there hoping, please crit, please crit, and he's gonna get the XP and survive. Cliff, you're a G. I don't know how he survived that. I mean, I guess we got lucky that they attacked Cliff and not him. <laughs> True that. True that. Man, he's just kind of low on health. That's the issue. I'd rather heal him up before attacking, but will you take less damage? I guess you have, maybe you have better defense. You have a 20% chance to crit too, so we'll go for it. Okay, well. Bit unfortunate, but he did 11 damage, so she should, she should survive the next attack, barring anything random. Yeah, he's gonna go for gray. Hang in there, gray. Yeah, you're good. Great a bomb. He's gonna go for Luthier. Okay. Thanks. Appreciate it. And Clive takes down this Baron. We're very close to taking down this guy. I think she should. No, she won't be able to. Um. What? I'm gonna have Gray take this guy down. Never mind. Fuck! Okay, can you kill him, Gra Gray? Alm. No, you miss one. Miss them both. Alm levels up, though. I mean, because Zeke can take down this dude with the Rider's Vein. Alright. Mueller has been killed. Sweet. Zeke levels up to level 5. We got another silver bow. Sweet. So I don't remember which team it was on. I think it was Celica's team. I turned a... Uh, uh, I turned a javelin into a... I don't remember. It's this weird Sonian. I'm pretty sure that's what it's called. Okay, thank you for going for Cliff, actually. And not... Gray. That's beautiful. Alright, Gray, retreat and go get healed. Zeke, do this. Finish the fight. Ha! And Tobin will get the final kill. Because Tobin's a G, and Tobin deserves it. And we did it! That was way... I'm, play, I'm still playing as recklessly as I did the entire rest of the thing. Most maps went very smoothly, but... Okay, great. Well, I can't... Selic is not even available right now. She's in the Duma Tower. So, you know. Okay. I don't think I got any new memory prisms. I really don't want to worry about getting attacked by another freaking Neko Dragon Horde. So we're just going to go and attack the king. Attacking Regal Castle. Turn our ninth of Wormstim. Then the fortress has fallen. It has, Your Excellency. I fear it's a matter of minutes until the Deliverance reaches the castle doors. Very well. We shall greet them with a sea of blades. I leave the rest to you, Messena. 
As your will commands, Your Excellency. Now go. Your Excellency, wait! Berkut. Sire, why have you not given me leave to join the front lines? I know I failed you at the border, but all the more reason I beg for this chance! A merciful leader may grant a second chance. Only a fool allows a third. Your Excellency! My army has no place for the weak. You'll remain here and watch in quiet. No. Please. Have mercy, sire. Your Excellency! Uncle! Alright, let's get this fight started. This one's much Brave easier, actually. Of Rigel, you have fought with courage and skill at my side these long years. But the hour of reckoning is upon us. Our empire's light is guttering. Now heed my words well. If I should fall, my final order is that you lay down your arms and surrender. I hear the young Zophian general is a man of mercy. If you have any love and loyalty for me, you'll not waste your lives this day. <sighs> That's Emperor Rudolph. This is strange. I'm not sure what I'm feeling at the moment. He's caused so much suffering, and I know I should hate him. But I can't. Instead, he just feels... I don't know. Familiar somehow? Ohm! Snap out of it, will ya? There's no time for daydreaming. We're at Regal Castle's doorstep, buddy. We need you focused. Now pull yourself together already. We didn't come this far to lose here. Uh, right. Sorry, Gray. All right, everyone. Let's do this! I don't remember. I'm pretty sure that I called it, actually, what the thing is if you haven't played it. Uh, so, I'm not gonna spoil it, though. Uh, we're gonna continue. We're just gonna get going here. All right, let's go. <laughs> I cut off poor foresight. I re I'm not. I don't really like the battle music here. I, I'm just not a fan of opera to begin with. All right, we're gonna just have Python attack this dude. Cool. Now my goal is to just get through this part as quick as possible. So. Uh, just get the entire team into the courtyard as quick as possible uh, so that we can focus on other things when it comes to these guys. I, I think I had Claire come up here and attack a... well, probably not attack a Bow Knight, actually. Because that did not... that didn't end up seeming to... Whatever I just said. Okay, we're gonna have Zeke lead the way in. Point is that we're just trying to get... Uh, God damn it, I left these guys too open. They dodge. I'm, I should have, I, the thing is I wanted to, what I did is I left these guys at the back. At least they don't do a ton of damage. Well, never mind, as I say that, Tatiana's so much weaker. Sorry, I just skipped through the turn, there's nothing even to see. It would have cut, and I think, literally, these guys, it's funny, so these guys, the entire battle, it's really funny what they do. So, uh, this, this guy goes first, he cuts his HP to put, do a, a health spell, uh, which is fortify, I believe, but he doesn't heal anything. Then this guy does it and heals up the other dude. So it's like, what? Hopefully you didn't. The green screen didn't wasn't too off because it's freaking stupid and gets stuck in my chair. Okay. Anyway, not important. Uh, we're gonna, just gonna head into the courtyard. We've got some foes to fight in here, and I wish it was simpler to get up on the ramparts. Uh, is she out of range? She is not. Of course she's not. All right, Delthea. You can't even hit him. You suck, Delthea. Wow, that is nothing. Zeke's in the way, that's why. I want to use Excalibur. Alright, 100% chance to hit, 32% chance to crit. He does not do that. Dodge? Nope, you don't crit. <laughs> or dodge. Damn it, Cliff. You gotta help me out here, man. Alright, Python, I'd really like you to take this dude out. He does, good. Alright. One guy down. Can you stop going from my healers? I hate... And there's gonna go Silk. So, nope, she survived somehow. Yeah, you don't do much to my knights, because they're... 
<laughs> of course you can read Silk. I'm sorry, Silk. That's so crap. Like, she has 13 defense, too. And she just can't take hits. It sucks. See, they just keep doing this. Literally back and forth. Come on. Like, come on. That is so dumb. The fact that they straight up go for the healers. That is the worst thing on the planet. I guess Python crit. I mean, sometimes just the animations are long and they don't, and they irritate me. Especially against Necro Dragons. Fighting Necro Dragons sucks because their movements are so slow. All right, good job, Gray. Thank you. Faye's gonna level up to level three. Only Tobin could have reached the other dude. Better than you expected? Oh, you have a writer's vein. Dandy. Like, when he has six resistance and you can't kill him with a thunder. That's not good. It's about the stupidest freaking thing. Clive levels up. All right, Luthier should take him out with Sagitte. So that dude's gone. Good job, Luther. Luthier. Level five for him, seven. I don't know why I said seven. All right, Delphi, if you could dodge. Thank you. Beautiful. And one archer, one more archer is down. Good job. Okay. Good stuff. Oh, you are gonna go for Delphi. Of course you are. Dodge, please. Dude, I hate that. Exactly. What is your deal? Ow! Please don't kill Python. I kind of need him. Of course he go for Python. He almost, he dodged one. So good job. Good try, Python. Straight up, this. It's so, it's just, it's not good. It's not fair. Just how much damage. Well, all right. You'll be fine. Just crit. But he doesn't crit. Thank you, Clive. Alright, one more dude is down. I mean, like, it would be simpler if we were able to just go straight in and attack the, the, the leader. But we gotta wait for others. All right, Claire, a, a crit could be really needed. Thank you. Not really needed, really used. Well, never mind. Thought she was doing more. All right, Gray's gonna kill the, the uh, Gold Knight. One of them. One of the Riders' Bane dudes. And I knew you had potential. We're very close to taking out the other one. I'm gonna. Can Luther hit this guy? Takes a ton of damage. Okay, Luthier takes care of that dude. Sweet. Okay, good job, guys. That was a great level up. Alright, I'm gonna have Allman, our Riders Bane guy, chart. I mean, I suppose it doesn't. Oh my. No. No. Oh, I hate you! At least no one else can hit hit him. Or hit her. Why did I say him? Oh. <laughs> as long as I get her out of the bow's, gu bow's range, it'll be fine. Cliff just now learned Sagittae. I thought he already learned it. Why are they still not charging us? I mean, that'll be good, good to get uh, Tobin close enough. We weren't even around the corner last time when they started moving toward us. So, I don't know, that's weird. Ah, oh, I didn't mean to click Cliff! Went too oh, it doesn't even matter. Tobin will be fine. If only I had Python to frickin' shoot this dude. I should have left all of them out in the open. Hang in there, Tobin. Thank you. Good job, dude. Alright, that's fine. Ow. It's funny how we just straight up threw it through his face. Hang in there, Tobin. Thank you. Tobin, you're the goat. He does only have a... Come on. To I need you to dodge, great. 
Ow! No, no, no one else can get him at the very least, but that sucks. If you could crit, that'd be amazing, Matilda. Ah! How much does Armor Crush do? Okay, does a total of 22 damage. That does 20 damage, but you take a lot less. Take four less, because four is the... I mean, he only does have that 34% chance to hit, so I'm going to go for Armor Crush. Thank you. Just wanted to see if I can do some damage. Okay, I'm going to have you go here and see if I can draw fire from this guy. Because that'd be good if I could. Might as well just shoot with my bow. Doesn't hurt anything. I suppose I didn't realize he was throwing a javelin because I'm an idiot. Actually, let's see if I can get Cliff close enough over here that he can attack from the side. I mean, I can't do much with these guys, so they just kind of have to wait. Okay, you're going to go for her. Thank you. The more who could... Ow! Please dodge, Gray. Thank you. Thanks, Gray the goat. Okay, Gray, please dodge. Please, I need you. I need you. I need you. I need you. Thank you. Oh, I gotta love Gray so much. Okay, good. He's gonna draw that Arcanist. She is. It's gonna hurt, but she's gonna draw that Arcanist away. And I have Cliff going over there. He dodged, so that's good. Alright. That turned out well. Or well enough, at least. I gotta just... I gotta take my chances. I gotta take the hit chance. I gotta go for it. Nope, of course I get unlucky. <sighs> if that were my attack, she would have missed. Alright, great, you're gonna get... You're, no, shush up. You're gonna get the chance to retreat. Oh, no, 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 I can rescue! I know what I... Oh, I can't... I'm just out of range, are you serious? Okay, I want to rescue Cliff. I want to bring Cliff up here. So that I can have uh, this dude up here. Okay, I want you to go here. And I want you to use the bow on this guy. You miss. Please dodge. Okay, you hit one. I would have rather you hit the two. Obviously. Thank you. Alright, we can take out this guy. Thank you. Alright, one more gone. Whew! There you go, Luthier. You're the, you're the, you're the man. I'm just gonna have <laughs> my knights go and attack the, the, the bow knight, because this guy's getting irritating. Freaking tried to injure Cliff. Yeah, take that, scrub. I don't think Forsyth can get close enough. Nah. Yeah, I don't know. Um... Shoot, I'm like debating on what I want to do, because I'd like to get rid of this guy. But I can't really do that, so I just gotta end turn. I feel like I just gotta wait. You're gonna fill in! God dang it! Are you, finished? you missed both the attacks with a 78%. See, that's what I'm talking about. That kind of luck is crap. Don't die. Thank you, Gray. Okay, they're both gonna retreat. That's nice. Okay. You should be able to take him out with Excalibur. Hey, you dodge his attack. You crit neither, which is surprising, but you take him out, so that's good. That makes things easier, because Alm can now do the deed. Let's get some other people, take out some other guys, and get some more XP. Just in payback for attacking us so much. Goodbye. Tobin levels up to level 7. Tobin a man. Alright, if you could hit Clive, you'd be the you'd be the best. Okay. Well, you're not as good as your... Well, you are actually pretty damn good. I was gonna say you're not as good as your wife, but that's not true. You just have worse resistance, that's about it. You're pretty equal otherwise. Okay, Zeke, you're just gonna come down here and attack this guy for no reason. Other than just, you might get just that little bit of extra XP. Alright, at least you dodged. Alright, Cliff can take him out with Excalibur. Okay, he does crit the second, but it doesn't matter because he would have killed him no matter what. And there we go. 
Good job, Cliff. Oh, Gray can reach him. All right, Gray, you're going to come over here and get revenge because he tried to kill you last turn. Indeed, level 5 for Gray. I hate how my healers just get obliterated immediately. It's about the most frustrating thing. The fact face arrive is a freaking miracle. Okay, here we go. Rudolph isn't attacking for some reason. He's in attacking for some reason. What's going on? Why won't you attack? What are you planning, Rudolph? Okay. I'm gonna have you come up here. All I know is you will not... I mean, I did put my units in danger, I suppose. How much damage can you do to him? Like, nothing? Okay. Well... We'll see who, if he's going to go after anyone. He actually is going to go after Tobin. And you're going to crit. Just F off. I really... Hold on. I want to see something. I want to see if Alm can get the Levin Sword from the Convoy. What's your resistance compared to your defense? Your resistance is absolute crap. I can't get it, can I? No. Because he died. Son of a biscuit, man. Okay, well, I'm just going to have to rely on Luther and Cliff to do a bunch of damage with Excalibur. Because all needs to finish him. Actually, Sagittate is so much more. Alright, you're gonna do as much damage as you can, Zeke. I'm sorry if you faint. Okay, you're good. You're gonna hang in there. Oh my gosh, screw you! I hate him! God, this is so frustrating. She's gonna crit, she's gonna do like three damage. Six, excuse me. And he's gonna crit too. Is he supposed to crit every time? Because there's not much I can do here. I need Lucas to come here and help, and I need you to freaking heal. Heal Gray. Oh my gosh, you're gonna go after Force. Dude, I'm, I'm not even sure we can do this this time. Because this is so. Like, he went down so quickly last time. Alm's a higher level than he was last time, I think. Actually, I could be completely wrong about that. Alright, I need you to crit. Ugh. Okay, well, I need you to at least hit Luthier. You're gonna kill him. You won't kill with Thunder, and maybe I can do that damage with Excalibur. Because I'd like Alm to be able to actually kill him. Thank you. Good, because, well, you'll see. There's more cutscene. There's more to this. This is as it should be. Alm levels up to level si five. Huh? Excuse me. Only speed. Great. And we win. That was so much more difficult. We only left like two units, or was it a single unit? You've done well. I'm proud of you, my son. What? I knew I was right to entrust you to my dearest friend. Your friend? You mean... my son? What's going on here? What are you saying? I thought you'd have realized by now your true name. Your true name is Albine Om Rudolph. You are my one and only son. I... What? That can't be true. You're lying. Why should I believe a word you say? <coughs> be still, Om. I haven't time left to explain. But I beg you to grant me one final favor. You want a favor from me? Take the divine fortune that sealed Miller's strength. Duma has become a thing of mindless evil. Use the blade and destroy him. Please, my son, you must. No, wait! Emperor Rudolph! Were you truly my father? Then I've just... 
Oh, gods. What have I done? <laughs> Um's voice actor is really good. Stop! Please, no more! Um, how has it come to this? The boy will come to slay Lord Duma ere long. A fool's errand, I fear, without falchion. Um is coming here? Please, you mustn't hurt him! My soul alone is all you need, yes? Oh? Then you will offer up your soul to Lord Duma willingly? I will. Um wouldn't if want it that. Om, I will surrender my soul gladly. <laughs> As you wish, Your Highness. Now come with me. All right, now we get to go into the castle. Uh, long live His Excellency Rudolph the Second. Welcome home, Prince Albine. I hope we'll learn more soon, because I really wonder... Welcome home, Prince Albine. I am Masena, captain of Emperor Rudolph's Imperial Guard. His Excellency told me everything before facing you in battle. Afterward, I gathered the remnants of his forces and awaited your arrival. He told you... everything? Are you telling me he knew he was going to lose? That he expected to die by his own son's hand? I am afraid I cannot speak to His Excellency's intentions. I humbly ask that you visit the throne and listen to what Sir Mycin has to say. Mycin is here? Hey Mycin, how you doing? Uh, before we talk, I'm, ex I'm just gonna scan the room real quick. See if I can find anything that I can just take for my own. Nah, there's nothing. Alright, let's talk. So you've come, Mom. Grandfather, what the hell is going on? What are you doing here? Rudolph said I was his son. And now all these people are calling me a prince. It's only natural that you're feeling confused. But there is no denying fact. You are the only son of Emperor Rudolph. Scion of the Regellian Imperial bloodline and true heir to Regel's throne. How could you? You knew all this time. And yet you kept it from me. You knew. And you still sent me off to kill my own father! Please remain calm, Holm. <sighs> Let me explain. Best I start at the very beginning. As you well know, Valentia has always been divided north from south. Split between the two gods, Mila and Duma. But their involvement with mankind eventually grew too deep. When madness takes a god, man is lost. And where gods meet ruin, men die too. That is the plight Valentia now faces. You're saying the gods are... dying? I fear so. Rudolph was among the first to understand the signs. He saw Duma's growing madness, and knew it for a harbinger of ruin. But then you were born home. What does that have to do with any of this? You bore the brand. Sign of the hero who would rise to save Valentia. Hearing that prophecy, Rudolph knew you must be kept hidden from the faithful. He concealed the news of your birth and entrusted you to me and Sophia. I will never forget the pain on his face when he placed you in my arms. <laughs> that day marked a change in him. He donned the mantle of one who would destroy the old world order. One who'd free men to live by their own power, even if they hated him for it. He knew such heresy would bring forth those who wished for his death. So for that death to come at the hand of his beloved son was a mercy. He told me himself that he could imagine no more peaceful end. And what of my peace? This is not the time for mourning or self-pity, boy. Rudolph's purpose now falls to you. The true foe you must defeat is Duma, as well as the zealots tainted by his madness who seek control of Valentia. Jeddah and his Duma faithful. 
If you do not hurry, Selica's life will also be in peril. Oh, God! Selica! She set out in search of Duma in order to save Mila. A passage beneath this castle leads to the Temple of Duma. Go, Alm. Go, and finish this. Return the mad god Duma to the darkness from whence he came. And General Meissen joins us. His whole story was a lie. Alm's youth, his days of training with Meissen. All were but calculations in a far-reaching plot by his lord father, Emperor Rudolf. Alm had taken his father's life, and that sadness would stay with him always. But destiny would not permit this son of the brand to simply walk away. Valentia lay yet in the grip of Duma, the wicked god, the war father, as well as Alm's dear Selica, who would become Duma's willing servant. All right, now we're going to end it. I did that outro a little bit premature uh, because I was forgetting. I thought it led right into that ending cutscene, but I forgot about the whole thing. So, uh, yeah, that's what we're going to end this episode. I hope you enjoyed it. Look, appreciate the next episode. We're going to be starting chap uh, not chapter, Act 5. So, we're nearly done with the game. It's crazy. As you see, the time I it took me to play this is literally less than half the entire time I took to play the first game through. So... Oh, I just kind of power through it, but I really hope you enjoyed it. It looks pretty, me subscribe for more, and I'll talk to you all later.